depends. It depends okay. on the night. It depends on where I am. No, but there's that special drink up here that you have. What's it called? That honey mead. Mead. Oh, mead. Mead. Yeah, yeah, mead. They'll knock you on your ass, bro. That's good shit. I just had a shot of that. I just did too. I just had something to get me in the fucking mood. Yeah. Okay. So like, how how do you warm up before going to stage? So do your push-ups or do like watch? Do a little exercise. Yeah. Do a little exercise. Pump a little weights. Do a little lifting. You know. Have a couple of have a couple of drinks here and there. Not not. We don't get fucked up before we play. We get loose. Pound a couple chicks. You know. Get yourself in the groove. Oh fuck yeah. Okay. That gets you in the mood, brother. Yeah. It's like when they play football. You can't have sex. The night before I don't know why they say that. I think you'd, I think you'd fucking play better. That's not true, you know. They did a study on athletes, and they said that they they it depends on the person. Some athletes played better if they had sex before because they were more relaxed, and some didn't because they you know the tension you know that they they were holding in kind of helped. Depends on the individual. We like to be really relaxed up on that stage. Right, exactly. Yeah, yeah. Before and after. <laughs> right. <laughs> right. <laughs> well, give, give me like a, a, a hint on what's, a, what's on the new album here, man. No, like, listen to the motherfucker and then interview us again. No fucking way. <laughs> this is going to have to be your festival report. Okay. All right? But, but, it's, I, but no, really, we're coming back We're coming back in the fall. Yeah. So yeah. listen to the fucking record, you know, check it out, see what's going on. Yeah. When we come back in the fall, yeah. then we'll do part two of the interview. Okay, cool. It'll be cool. That's an idea, man. Good Absolutely. Idea, man. Very nice. Definitely. That's a deal, man. No, really, it's, <laughs> yep. it's actually better for you because we'd rather have you do a report on the festival, what's going on. Yep. Cause a lot of the stuff we've been talking about here is backstage stuff anyway. Yep. Mm-hmm. You know, and now you can, you know, listen to the record, get a vibe for yep. what's happening. Plus, we're going to come back, like I said, in the fall with a big fucking, you know, production. Yep. And we're going to do some serious damage up here. And so then we can pick up the interview then. It'll be really cool. Uh... I did see Manuel last time. I'm sorry, I must have been sick or broken a leg or something. But but uh, the time before that, I watched you in, in uh, Copenhagen, and uh, you are for certain the loudest band on the planet. More or less, mm-hmm. Absolutely, so. you're right. Not more or less. Did you see you us are. at the Sweden Rock Festival no, in '99? Oh right. fuck, no. you missed it. Did you read but, the paper the next day? No, I didn't. No. Oh fuck. <laughs> what happened, man? We an annihilation, man. What the fuck you think happened? Yeah, <laughs> what's happening? Annihil- the annihilation. The it's a fucking hungry band. Again out there and does nothing but kick yeah. fucking ass yeah. really and that's what we're that's all right. about yeah, yeah, yeah. well you'll see it today and the Swedish people are into it totally and that's a lot of Swedes out there as well fuck and, yeah and German people yeah of sure. course a lot of, a lot of yeah people. because they're fucking crazy yeah, like, and they're here to fucking have their head blown off yeah, I like to drink a beer sometimes man fuck yeah listen to Man Wolf fuck yeah man <laughs> somebody said you know somebody said well, in fact this is good for you okay. somebody said well can you tell me what the new album's like I said absolutely it's very simple Go home tonight, pull down your pants, right to about here, right about your knees. You don't have to take them off, right about to there. Get some gasoline, about a glass like that. Pour it all over your balls and light it. That's what the fucking Man War album is like, okay? That's what the fuck it sounds like. Oh, that would be a cool way to round up an interview, man. <laughs> That's it. We're out of here. <laughs>